I have no idea what this thing is. Looks like some kind of egg with something moving inside of it. I'm using a Canon T1i in video mode 720p I'm shooting through a Nikon Fluofot microscope using a E40X objective with a camera adapter and a 10x objective projector lens inside the adapter so this is roughly 400 power plus the 1.6x sensor so I guess it's a little over 600x about 600 power have a light gray filter uh, yeah uh, have a light gray filter in line here using the halogen bright field light move through some different focus here some depth this is really right now this is about the limit of my magnification I've never seen anything like this quite like this though and this thing beside it with the three or four cells and the green things inside each cell I don't, I don't quite seen anything quite like that before either can't tell if these cells are dividing or if it's just one thing like a worm or something inside there moving around it looks like it is changing from when I first saw it though maybe cell division or something doesn't seem to be getting any bigger though Okay, I'm going to pause this video here and then take it up a little bit later just so the overall file doesn't get too huge and we pick up here a few minutes later doesn't seem to be much change it's still moving
changing focus here to try and get a different depth of it. Can't really get a sense of the shape of whatever is inside there though. Whatever it is, it's interesting. Now what this is, is this came out of a sample of uh, some kind of a dried fungus I found on the side of a dead tree, tree laying in the woods. And I put it in a petri dish and then soaked it for a few days in water. And this is a couple drops of uh, water that I used to pipette to pick up out of the petri dish and put on a depressed slide, depression slide. It looks like some kind of a helix thing inside there, but can't really tell if it's one cell or several or what the heck it's doing in there. Maybe it's some kind of bug larva, but still it's 600 power. It's pretty tiny for that, for any bug. Okay, we'll take another little break here time-lapse break well I still don't see any change overall still moving See if I can get some more contrast out of this depth of field here. The iris on the condenser. Close that down quite a bit. Let's see, give it some more light to make up for it. Open up the field diaphragm a little bit. Okay, that doesn't seem to help much. This new fluofot's got so many gizmos to turn and use and put in and out it's just okay let me turn down the light intensity and I'll get rid of that filter there maybe this will help oh. Close the field diaphragm a little bit. Open up the condenser iris. Just 
adjust the focus a little bit. I don't see much, uh, much change there. Okay. I guess we got all of that we can get. 